Hey everyone, and welcome back to Aim Apple. Today we're diving deep into the world of Mac settings, uncovering hidden gems that can completely transform your user experience. These aren't just cosmetic tweaks, we're talking about settings that will boost your productivity, streamline your workflow, and make you a Mac master. So grab a cup of coffee and let's optimize your Mac. Part 1. Conquering the Chaos Finder the Finder is your gateway to all your files and folders. Let's take control. Finder sidebar, your personalized navigation panel. Clean up the clutter, right-click on unused items and select Remove from sidebar. Essential folders at your fingertips, drag frequently used folders from your Mac to the sidebar for instant access. Finder views, tailor made for you. List view for clarity, switch from the default icon view to list view for a clear, categorized view of your files and folders. Show path bar, never get lost again. Enable the show path bar at the bottom of the finder window. This displays your current location within the folder hierarchy, making it easy to navigate back and forth. Status bar, know your size. Enable the status bar at the bottom of the finder window. This displays the total size of the current folder and its contents, helping you manage disk space effectively. Customize your toolbar. Efficiency is key. Toolbox of choice. Right-click on the toolbar and select Customize Toolbar. Here, you can drag and drop frequently used functions like New Folder or Get Info for easy access. Remove unused icons for a clean and streamlined look. Search smarter, not harder. Focus your search. By default, Spotlight searches your entire Mac. To narrow down the results, click the drop-down menu in the search bar and choose this folder to limit searches to the current folder you're in. Open with confidence. Default app decisions. Right-click on a specific file type like PNG or JPG and select Get Info. Click the drop-down menu next to Open With and choose your preferred application to ensure files always open in the correct program. Welcome home. Set your default landing zone. Go to Finder Settings and click General. Here, choose the folder you want Finder to open to when you launch it. This could be your Documents folder, Downloads folder, or any other location you access frequently. Smart Folders, Automation at your service, Smartly Organized, in the Finder menu bar, go to File and click New Smart Folder. This creates a dynamic folder that automatically displays files based on criteria you set, for example, recently opened folders. Part 2. Optimizing your workspace, desktop and dock. Let's personalize your desktop and streamline your dock for a more efficient workflow. Widgets, information at a glance. Go to System Settings and head to Notifications and Extensions. Enable widgets for apps you use frequently, like Calendar or Notes, for quick access to information right on your desktop. Desktop Cleanliness, Show or Hide. External Drives, go to System Settings and click General. Under Settings, you can choose to show or hide external drives on your desktop for a cleaner look. Use Dock Like a Pro, out with the unused, drag unwanted apps out of the dock to remove them. Dock it at the left or right. Go to System Settings, click Dock and Menu Bar. Under Position on Screen, choose Left of Screen for easy access. Scale it down. Change the size of the dock to a size that suits your needs. Minimize with Style. Under Minimize Windows Using, choose Scale Effect for a smoother animation. Minimize to Application Icon. This prevents windows from taking up space in the dock. Go to System Settings and Dock and Menu Bar and check Minimize Windows into Application Icon. No more suggested apps. Uncheck Show Suggested and Recent Applications for a cleaner dock that only displays the apps you use regularly. Hot Corners, Quick Access Defined. Go to System Settings, click Desktop and Screen Saver and choose Hot Corners. Assign specific actions, like Mission Control Sleep, to different corner combinations by clicking on the drop-down menu and choosing your desired action. Part 3. Refining the user experience. Menu bar. Information on demand. Show battery percentage. Go to System Settings. 
Under Control Center, check Battery. This displays the exact battery percentage right in the menu bar. Bluetooth at your fingertips. Similar to the battery, check Bluetooth in the Control Center options to easily manage your Bluetooth connections from the menu bar. Streamlining the Spotlight Search. While Spotlight is powerful, you might not need it readily accessible. Go to System Settings, Spotlight Search and Privacy. Here you can uncheck folders you don't want indexed by Spotlight, making the search function more focused on the information you use most. Trackpad, mastering the touch. Speed up your navigation. Go to System Settings and click Trackpad. Under Tracking Speed, adjust the slider to your preference for a smoother and faster cursor movement. Tap to click for convenience. Enable tap to click for a more click-like experience when tapping the trackpad. Natural scrolling, not for everyone. While natural scrolling mimics a mobile device, some users prefer the traditional scrolling direction. You can disable natural scrolling in the trackpad settings. Three finger drag, effortless window management, Enable three-finger drag to easily move windows around your desktop using three fingers on the trackpad. This is a great way to quickly organize your workspace. System settings, hidden gems for efficiency, multiple fingerprints for Touch ID, go to system settings, Touch ID and password. You can add multiple fingerprints for faster and more secure authentication. Fine-tuning your user experience. Say goodbye to autocorrect. Go to System Settings and select Keyboard. Under Text, you can uncheck options like Correct Spelling Automatically or Capitalize Words Automatically if you prefer more control over your typing. Adjust Mouse Settings, head to System Settings and search for Mouse. Here, you can personalize tracking speed, scrolling behavior and button configuration to match your settings. Display, Comfort and Clarity. Take control of brightness. Go to System Settings. Click Displays. Uncheck Automatically Adjust Brightness for manual control over your screen brightness. This is helpful for finding the perfect balance between screen clarity and battery life. True Tone versus Night Shift. True Tone adjusts the screen color temperature based on ambient light. While some users prefer it, others find it distracting. You can disable it in the display settings. For a warmer screen at night to reduce eye strain, consider using Night Shift also in display settings or a third-party app like Flux. By implementing these settings, you'll transform your Mac into a personalized productivity powerhouse. Remember, experimentation is key. Find the settings that work best for you and enjoy a more efficient and enjoyable Mac experience. If you found this guide helpful, give it a thumbs up, subscribe for more tips and share it with friends.